Hi, I'm Benjamin Hill with Mission Physical Therapy. In earthquake prone areas of the world, like Japan and California, places like that, and especially in these areas where there are large buildings, um, tall buildings, uh, they've learned that a rigid building just is not gonna hold up very well in an earthquake. When the ground gets moving, that building's more likely to come down. And so in some of these places, architects have designed uh, buildings that sit upon rollers uh, down at the foundation. They have rollers where, where that building can actually shift and move when the ground moves and so it's less likely to topple over. And some buildings um, are put on springs, heavy duty, really large springs to support these buildings and, and, and they use that same principle where the springs allow for some movement so that building is less likely to come down. Our bodies are really similar. Well, anyone who's very stiff and rigid is less likely to be able to adapt to a variable terrain or surface that they walk on and the movement that they are doing or if they get bumped in a crowded area um, and they may feel very uneasy. In many places uh, we'll work with them on their balance and their posture but often don't do uh, don't spend too much time helping them to be less rigid and, and to loosen it up. So should we have more mobility in our hips and our ankles we're a lot less likely to lose our balance. And so with a combination of manual therapy, joint manipulation and mobilization and stretching, uh, our patients can uh, regain the mobility that they've lost, that looseness that allows them to adapt and uh, be less likely to come down when their ground starts shaking a little bit. I'm Benjamin Hill with Mission Physical Therapy.